Hello everyone, welcome to a new vlog here in Casey Hughes. My name is Casey. Welcome to my channel. I have been editing the vlogs that I've recorded this year so far and it made me want to start vlogging again. Also the fact that it's Mother's Day weekend and last year apparently I didn't vlog it or really do anything with it. I think I worked the night before so things might have got a little wonky for me. Um, but I was looking for like the recipes of everything I made for Mother's Day and I couldn't find what I cooked because I made some yummy stuff that everyone really liked. So I was like looking for it, trying to figure out, you know, if I had it recorded or documented anywhere. I had the hardest time, but I finally went through my phone and I found screenshots of all the recipes I used, which worked out okay. But I'd rather have had a vlog to look back on to see what I made or how I made it or whatnot. So yeah, I just am in the mood to start vlogging again. I've been watching a couple of vloggers that I love and always have loved and they just have inspired me to start up again so it'll you know be periodic and not every single day weekly vlogs of course edited weekly but yeah I just wanted to start doing this again with the weather shaping up and I actually I'm going to Florida in like two weeks so that's exciting I'm at my parents right now because our backyard is currently under construction aka we're growing grass back there and the dogs cannot go back there so we're here at my mom's and we're gonna go in their backyard so these guys can take a poopsie there's like no grass in our backyard it's been an issue all winter so we're finally brendan planted some seed it's probably been like three or four days that they haven't been able to go in the back. It's been hard. Um, these two don't really like to poop in um, in the front yard. We've just been laying them out in the front and obviously the front is not fenced in. We don't have an invisible fence or anything like that. So it's been a challenge. So let's go see Cuzzies and let these guys run for a sec. Oh, hi everyone. So I'm done running errands and I'm home. I changed my shirt because the dogs like jumped all over me at my parents' house. Winnie just is like constantly hopping and hopping. I don't know about this headband right now. I want to take it off. I'm about to eat some lunch. It's actually like almost three o'clock. I went to Staples to make a return. They had the, hap is it called Happy Returns? I had some stuff from a boutique that, what are you doing? That I didn't like the way it fit or you know whatever I had to return it and luckily they had the happy return so it's so easy to just like drop it off um, but I also had to return something at the post office for Shein which is e easy as well you just print the thing and stick it on the package so two easy returns next to Staples was the Dollar Tree and actually I had to get like tape to put on my package for the post office so I got that there and a couple of things for the dogs um, and then I went to Aldi. I got a couple of things that I needed for like our Cinco de Mayo dinner. By the way, it's Cinco de Mayo. Um, so I got a couple of things like I need uh, cilantro and strawberries. I'm gonna make a strawberry margarita, so that'll be good. And speaking of margarita, I also went to the liquor store because I didn't have any tequila. I got this Espanol. Espolon Tequila Blanco Pure Agave. I liked the packaging. There's like a skeleton on a Brewster. <laughs> so I got that. I did a Target pickup order. We went to Starbucks. Where's my Starbucks? It's on the counter. The house is a mess. I had so much to do today and I still have to do stuff. So I'm gonna eat this quick lunch. This is leftovers from last night. I'll insert a picture of what it looked like last night. But it looks pretty dang good today. It's like a lemon regat pasta with basil and parmesan. So I'm going to eat this and watch some YouTube and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Oh, a bunch of my orders came in and one of them was from Victoria's Secret Pink. So I put this on. It's more of a Cinco de Mayo color, I think, than the blue. 
I don't know. I'm just gonna eat and then start doing some cleaning around here. It's a mess. It's a mess. Happy Cinco de Mayo from my margarita to yours. I don't like the salt. I made myself a taco salad. Taco bowl, there's rice in there, and a taco. We're gonna watch Criminal Minds and enjoy our Cinco Feast. Are we on? <laughs> Hi everyone. I didn't like vlog yesterday. I meant to. I had my vlog camera like in the car ready to go. And then I didn't, I didn't do it. I just, I don't know what happened. Yesterday, um, I got some groceries for Mother's Day. We went and got flowers for Mother's Day too. I got this beautiful um, hanging basket of flowers from Crazy Daisies. They had the most beautiful flowers and the widest selection I've ever seen. I will always buy my flowers from them as far as like, well, yeah, like a garden shop goes. But my florist, I still love my florist from my wedding besides the point. Um, and then I also went with Brendan and met Morgan at Sharky's for drinks and to watch my cousin's uncle's band play. large and in charge right now but I was really digging this outfit before I left but I don't know if I want to wear it now so it is Saturday now and it is Morgan's actual birthday so I'm trying to convince her or trying to figure out where we want to go for a couple hours this afternoon and then later on is my cousin AJ's birthday party so we got that going on I am just about to drop something off at my parents house talk to you guys in a little bit oh yesterday was national nurses day and now it's officially nursing week so I'm excited to see what maybe we get something at work this week I don't know but we shall see I'll talk to you guys in a bit Happy 
How? I don't know. There might still be something on the lens. Hello, everyone. It is Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Yeah, um, happy Mother's Day. Sorry I didn't vlog yesterday. I'm just having good conversation with my friend on her birthday at the brewery, and I'll leave the snaps in here if I didn't already talk about that. But, yeah, I don't think I did. Morgan and I went to Skinny Atlas Brewery for a couple brewskis, and it was fantastic. Their um, beers are phenomenal. Really enjoyed that. We got really good food from a food truck too. They had like all this like smoked meat and like it was just really good barbecue food. And then we went, well I we left the brewery and I went to my cousin AJ's birthday and it was good catching up with my family. I actually haven't seen like my extended family since uh, my birthday. So that was a long time ago. So that was wonderful and then I came over to my parents and Devin and I prepped for Mother's Day until 2 in the morning making some recipes so I'll have to show you what we made I'm gonna park in the driveway my dad's been parking in the lawn so <laughs> you snooze you lose oh the cat's out all right I'll talk to you guys in a couple minutes that was really cute it was that was really cute can you do it again can you do it again, Miss Ro? Hi, baby. I just think you're the cutest kitty I have ever seen. Are <laughs> you chomping at my cookie? You need help? Ready for your gift? I think everybody cry today. I know. I don't cry over things. Why do we like making people cry? Isn't that funny? But it's like tears of joy. How beautiful. Do you like them? Yeah, I love them. Thank you. I love them. They're from Crazy Daisies. Oh my god. So many flowers. So those many. Are they are, they're so full. Oh, I like the yellow. Oh, the, those are good complementary colors. I like yeah. Like a orangey red and they're a yellow. Oh. I never thought about oh, wait. Oh, wait. Part. oh, shoot. Are we ready to pop some champagne in this? I'm ready. Maybe I'm not. <laughs> Love that sound. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Here's our spread. I'm gonna unveil the casseroles. French toast roll up casserole and breakfast pizza. Bagels, croissants, waffles, pancakes, hash browns, eggs, sausage, bacon. And my quiche is gonna be like another half an hour. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Cheers. Mm. Your brunch hostess with the mostest. They got everything covered. Yes. Right, Winnie? I don't either. You're living here. Winnie. Winnie. You know. Devin's beautiful lemon loaf. Blueberry. Blueberry. Blueberries, blueberries. Hello everybody, I never ended the vlog on Mother's Day. It's then Monday, I went right to work. And then Tuesday, yesterday, I got a haircut. So 
So now that I got my hair done, the birds are chirping. I'm wide awake. Before my haircut, I couldn't really sleep because I was afraid I was going to sleep through my appointment. So I'm in a predicament. I have to work tonight and tomorrow I have to stay up all day because it's my only day off before I go to Florida. And I just don't know what to do with myself. I guess I'll try to force myself to go to sleep. What other choice do I have, right? Oh yeah, sorry. Also, yeah, I got a haircut after three years, so it's nice and fresh. And now it's Wednesday. Hopefully I will vlog for um, my week going up to Florida. Um, sorry, I'm actually way more congested now since I went back to work. Oh, really? The place makes me sick. We are tie-dyeing. Mm -hmm. oh, we're going to Florida in about a week. So my sister and I are making our own shirts for the Magic Kingdom, which we're going to for one day. So there's another blush color. Oh right? yeah, there is. We are making tie dye shirts and then I'm going to put a graphic over it, which I'll share with you guys later. So I'm going to tie dye this. You can watch me and uh, yeah, I'm going to get going because I'm sweating. Here's my shirt. You started with the dark and then mutt light. Yeah. Oh, did the light part go where the, like, the white is? Hi guys, so it's a little bit later. Um, Molly and I got some Starbucks and did a Target run, and now it's um, about 5.30 and we're going up to um, a little garden cafe that we all know and love called Crazy Daisies. I've vlogged there before, and it's my aunt's birthday so we're gonna get some cocktails and just sit outside because it's beautiful. It's almost like 80 degrees, if not a little bit over 80. So we're going, I'm wearing this Floor Zodiac shirt from Target that I love. Um, the same jeans I was wearing earlier. Don't mind all the shoes on the floor. And my new Birkenstocks. So that's the fit. And I just took some Flonase. Look at my dog. <laughs> Hi Simba. You are a very handsome gentleman. What do you have to say for yourself today? Did you have a good day? Here's the other one. Alright, going. Bye Beanie, bye Samba, I love you. Happy birthday. Thank you. This We're is here. so nice, there's ice breeze up here. Every Wave. time I come by here, I look up and it looks so cute. Just the sun's the, behind me. The yeah. Wood. But yeah, it is cute. The, the wood. wood. But like the wood, you know, the wood. <laughs> The porch it looks like there. a little cabin. It feels so nice out it right really now. It is. See, there's always a nice breeze. Even though it's, it's beautiful. warm, it's perfect right now. It's not very humid, the breeze. <laughs> That's what it is. Uh, yeah, the breeze keeps it like I perfect. I asked for a non-humid like, day on my special day, and it works. It's not uh, huge. Yeah. <coughs> oh. Nine. You're not how old are you? How old are you? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. 
That wasn't a good thing. Cheers. 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 I'll go get it if you want it. I got a honey crisp lime. Do you want hand sanitizer? Yeah, maybe. Honey crisp lime. I don't. I don't. Although, lemon. Then I just wipe and the sticky cherry out begonia. I put this in my hair, but sour. So you can eat it. I don't want to oh, eat I have it. some white. Irish whisper, bourbon, Hello everyone, it is Wednesday. Um, 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 um. I've been getting ready for my trip as of last night when I got home from my parents after my Aunt Kim's cake. And then this morning, I did a lot of laundry folding, some organization for packing. I'm trying to kind of plan my outfits. Um, I know, I'm pretty sure I know what I'm gonna wear. I know what I'm gonna wear on at Disney World and I'm pretty sure I know what I wanna wear for Universal. <clears throat> so I'm excited. I have like everything laid out. I just haven't like placed everything in my suitcase yet. I have to I'm waiting on a couple of orders that I placed for like my jean shorts that I ordered and um some laundry that I'm still washing. And I don't even know what else, but um, and a couple of things I'll obviously have to pack last minute because we don't leave for is it a week from today or a week from tomorrow? Yeah, I think we leave a week from tomorrow. And I work every single day, so I'm gonna just try to get the bulk of everything I have to do done today. So it's almost noon now. I'm over at my parents because I have to wash out my tie dye shirt. So I'll show you guys what that looks like when. Uh, we're done. Oh, hi there. Wow, my face looks so round right now. Holy crap. Is this what I look like to the world? <laughs> hi, everybody. I was going to make a weekly vlog leading up to my vacation, right? Well, I worked seven nights in a row, and it's safe to say that I had no time to vlog during that time. Uh... <laughs> But I'll leave all the snaps in from all my nights of work right here. I've been trying to get the dust because Pam's here. Sucks.
And yeah, I still have some packing to do now that I'm officially done with my seven night stretch. And I cannot tell you how relieved I am that that is all over. And I wish this would, f I, unfortunately, I wish this would focus on my face. I'm blocking this right here, okay. So, I think I might have to do that every time I turn this on, like put my hand up in the background. So, I'm gonna, I just got home from work. I went and got a bagel from Water Street Bagel. They're very fancy bagels, they're very delicious gourmet bagels. I got a bagel and a coffee. I went to the ATM and got some cash out for the trip. Now I'm home, I got my doggos fed but they're not eating yet. Here's Mr. Simb. And then Nana, where are you? Don't. The state of my home is a little wonky, obviously, because I've been working seven 12 shifts in a row, starting off with a 16 hour shift. I leave tonight and I still have to pack and stuff. So I'll wrap up this vlog showing you what I got going on. But first things first, I have to take a shower. I just want to get in there. I'm actually chilled to the bone. It's been really warm, but today is in like the low 50s, so it's a little chilly and gloomy, which makes it even feel chillier. So I'm gonna get in the tub, shave, do all the vacation prep for today when we leave later this evening. So yeah, I'm so tired. Hey everybody, so it's a little bit later. It's actually one o'clock now. I don't know what time it was the last time I vlogged, however, I do know that I still have some stuff to do. We're gonna leave around 3.30, so I have like an hour and a half. Actually like two hours before we leave. I decided I'm just gonna get the doggos out of the house, bring them to get puppuccinos because I have tremendous guilt for My leaving them. Know. Right, doggos? Sh let's see, let's see you. <gasps> My pretty dog. So yeah, I'm gonna miss them, so I'm gonna bring them for a little treat. Wow, my double chin just like is part of my life. I did my lashes, and I have to do a couple of things at home before I leave as well. I have to print something for Brendan. I have to order their dog food so that that comes while I'm gone. And I don't even know. I had to like reconfigure my stuff because Allegiant is what we're flying with and if you know anything about Allegiant you have to have your checked bag below 40 pounds and then I think probably for most airlines your carry-on has to be a certain width height and depth so I have the biggest maximum height width and depth I have a very nice luggage set, trio set, that I have a lot of freedom to pack how I need to. Um, I was packed with my checked bag with my largest piece of luggage, but I switched it over to the medium size to see if that would lighten it because I couldn't get below 47 pounds. If it was a 50, I would probably be fine with my large piece of luggage, but since it's 40, I downsized. And then I upsized my carry-on so that I could put more stuff in the carry-on and less in the checked bag. So, I don't really know where they get off. <laughs> Making the flights cheaper just, you know, by requiring you to pack lighter. But I hope that that works out. I hope that the carry-on doesn't have to meet a maximum minimum requirement um, I think my carry-on is 25 pounds so it's still pretty light and then I have my personal item which is also kind of like the maximum size of a personal item you can bring on I can't travel light for the life of me I've been watching packing videos all week and I just can't get the hang of not over packing I want to have all the options and um, not regret bringing something and not wearing it and then not having something to be, you know, to back it up. What is this truck doing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Very gloomy here today. It's raining and it's gray and it's gross. I couldn't 
bring the dogs to the dog park because it started raining a couple hours ago so that flew out the window so puppuccinos and the going back home it is so I'll talk to you guys later I'm kind of gonna wrap this vlog up soon and then the next one you see will be the whole entire duration of us in Florida from flight to flight from takeoff to landings if you want to watch any of my travel vlogs from years past like I went to Disney World in 2014 vlogged the whole thing every single day we were there for 10 days staying in the bubble living our best lives and this trip Disney trip we're not staying in the bubble but we're going to Magic Kingdom um, and then Universal look at Simba's face oh my god so that's where I'm at I'll show you guys my Starbucks drink once I get it my second one of the day I figure if I'm not going to take a nap, I might as well get two Starbuckses. Say bye, doggos. I'll talk to you later. So this is what I have here. This is going to be my check bag. Right here. My carry-on and my personal item. And I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I didn't really show you guys like what I packed. Because I'm not the person to look towards to get any advice when it comes to packing. I'm going to Florida for a week. And I couldn't tell you the best way to go about packing. Um, so, I will let you watch the millions of other videos there are out here on YouTube. Showing you how to pack a good carry-on, what have you. For your trips. I'm going to finish my coffee. I'm going to eat some tater tots and uh, put on my little airport outfit and it's going to be about time to go. So thank you for watching this vlog for whatever it was and I'll see you all in the next vlog when I'm in Florida. Well leaving for Florida. I'll be here at this house um, still in a couple minutes and it'll be the next video. But thanks for watching. Okay, bye. Love you all. See you another time. Bye.